Okay, uh, we're going to set up uh, today uh, security onion. Okay, uh, security onion. This is an open source uh, software wherein you can monitor all the traffic in your environment. So this is our topology. We have the internet. We have a firewall one interface. We have LAN interface of the firewall, and we have a switch which is our L3, and we're going to monitor that port. Um, 18 and send the traffic to port 19 and we have ESXi with two interface and we have a virtual security onion so this is our topology and we have a internet switch we have the L3 switch I'm going to show you the um, configuration so I configure here a span monitoring. Uh, we're monitoring the port 18 and sending to port 19. The port 18 is our uplink to the firewall. Okay, this is the topology. And the port 19 will be the snipping port. There's no configuration, but it's only monitoring the snipping port of the security onion so let's go let's try to download the um, ISO file of the security onion um, you need to download the ISO file once you download the ISO file um, I will not show anymore this one you can start uh, building your BM. Okay, so you can build your own BM by using a VMware uh, client or you can use the GUI. I'm using the old version of ESXi, so I, I, I can use this uh, um, VMware client. So we'll use um, Linux. Ubuntu Linux 64-bit Okay, click next Then we will use two interface Because uh, one interface is for the monitoring And the other one is for uh, snipping One is for management and the other one for snipping Okay, so uh, next so we're going to put thin provision let's put uh, 50 gv so we have a uh, capacity then we'll edit it we'll change the memory cpu let's put um two okay four cores and memory we'll put at least um let's start using 16 gb okay the more the better if you have okay then we're going to mount the iso that we downloaded i already uploaded the iso on my uh, esxi then click finish then we're ready we power on the bm let me double check okay let's power on the bm okay with security onion using the installer just press enter then let the installer run wait for a while okay after finish it will show like this you need to click double click install security onion okay click continue choose english okay then don't click download updates just click continue there is another way of doing the updates of security onion then install now it will erase the disk that we provisioned the 50 gb just continue
then we'll select the location so I'll put Dubai then we'll choose the keyboard click continue then we'll put the name so Arnel and the name of the computer Arnel security onion then the username and the password okay then it let it install Just wait for a while. Let me post the video. Okay, it's still installing. Let me post the video. Okay. It will reboot after. Okay, let's put the username and the password. This time we're going to click setup. Let's enter the password. Okay, these are the application Lagstas, Kavana, Squ Squirt, Seek, Snort. Just continue. Yes, configure this interface. So the first interface is our management, wherein you can manage the security onion. We'll put a static IP because I want to use a static IP. So let's go into put 10.128.1.16. We'll put the mass slash 24 and the gateway is that one. Let's put uh, 888 DNS and let's put my domain afabustan.com. Okay. Then, yes, configure sniffing interface. Now we'll configure the sniffing interface, which is our monitoring in our span port in our switch. So let's select this one. And these are the summary, then make changes then reboot okay let's put the username and password this time um, Okay, well, let's wait for a while. Okay. Okay, then click uh, setup again. Okay. Then put the password. Yeah, yes, continue. Then yes, skip network configuration. Then we have an option evaluation mode and production mode. 
So if you are first time in Security Onion, you need to select Evaluation Mode because uh, production, it will take a lot of resources. So suggested is if you are doing for the first time, uh, use Evaluation Mode. Okay. So this is our monitor interface. We'll create the username, the password, this is for our Kivana, Squirt, and the rest of the application in Security Onion. Let's put the username, okay. Then, yes, proceed with the changes. Okay, just click uh, okay. Then click OK again. These are the guidelines. You can follow these guidelines for your reference. OK. Just click OK. At the moment, only 422. It's open. OK. On this firewall, you need to allow uh, port 443 so that you can access this ESXi from uh, other um, server. So let's open the terminal. This time we're going to update it. So sudo soap. This is the proper way of updating the um, this uh, security onion. Okay, so this one will take time. So after that one, after the update, it will require reboot, okay? Maybe I'm going to post the video because this will take time. Now it's time to access the security onion. So now I'm access, I am already enabled this access to my computer so I can see now we have here the cyber chef okay you can do like they call it bake here I need to find out how to use that one and we have a squirt in squirt you can see all it's like a uh, ideas okay you can see like uh, uh, malicious traffics You have a lot of information here in the summary, the events in the summary. These are the top IPs and destination, and you, there's a view also. In summary, you can uh, see a lot of things. This security onion is a very powerful tool, and it's uh, open source and free. I start uh, loving using uh, open source um, software. Very nice product. And this is the most interesting, the Kibana. It has a built-in Kibana also. In Kibana, you can see a lot because you're tapping the uh, firewall interface and the switch where it's connected okay that means you you can see all the traffic it's like a uh, eagle eye you know you can see a lot of information here everything inbound and outbound traffic from your internet you will see it it's like uh, you have the power to monitor everything North, South, and South to North.
traffic we can put here last 24 hours and last week okay um, last 15 minutes okay I have run this one uh, for so many days now that's why we have a lot of data now so here you have a you can visualize and you can put a dash you can click dashboard as well as well in the dashboard you can see um, the summary like the report like for example here uh, number of logs okay and let's check um, sick notices okay we have a log count of 166 okay see so many information we have also let's check it one by one ls alert let's see what is ls alert come on ls alert okay so 13,499 these are the ls alert connection lag uh, who, who lagging new idea to events so many information see all the information and ideas SNMP. okay let's check dns query So many DNS uh, query here. Okay, these are the public IP address. See, this tool is very powerful tool. Uh, I hope you enjoy this uh, video, and I I really enjoy this video. And I enjoy this uh, uh, product. I will keep using it. Let's see HTTP traffic. These are the HTTP traffic. In my next video, maybe I will try to learn. Let's check the software. I will try to learn the Kali Linux. Kali Linux is also a powerful tool wherein you can do a pen test. Um, most of the CMD guys use that uh, software. So I'm going to learn that one and how to use it. So that's all. I hope uh, you enjoyed this video. Uh, click subscribe if you like this video and click bell. Thank you for watching.